Point try, Hawks with a rebound. Gears, outlet pass stolen. Here's Montague ahead of the field for the slam. Sean Montague has made an immediate impact for Southern New Hampshire University in his first season. Montague was a highly sought after Division I prospect in high school, but after a concussion sidelined him for most of his senior season, he began his collegiate career at Sacred Heart University. My recruitment in high school was, uh, was very active. I had a bunch of Division I programs, but at, at my senior year, I had a concussion, and I missed, I, I missed a, lot of, a lot of games. Therefore, I went to Sacred Heart and then to Lee College, and then now I'm here. And the journey's been amazing. There's been some highs and some lows, but it's that's why I'm here today. Montague transferred from Sacred Heart to Lee College, a small community college just outside of Houston, Texas. Three schools in three years required Montague to adjust both on and off the court. Um, it took me a while because in community college, there's just um, not a lot of people or not many people come to your games, not much coverage. But over time, I learned to uh, adjust to where I am now. And now it's just very, Easy for me, and I know a lot of people here, so I'm very comfortable up here. Montague received various offers after his one season at Lee College, which ultimately led him to not choosing a school until August. This was a positive for Southern New Hampshire because a familiar face for Montague arrived on campus in June. I had a few options coming out of JUCO, and in which my decision made it much later. I'm actually committed here in August, which is very late. So, but Coach Perry used to uh, coach at LAU Brooklyn, and. Sacred Heart and LIU Brooklyn are in the same league. Therefore, I played Coach Perry twice. And I think he recruited me in high school. So I was very familiar with Coach Perry, which made the decision much easier to play for uh, SNU. And just, just he's new as I, and I'm new, so it was a very easy decision for me. Montague knew about the Northeast 10 Conference before joining the Penman, and he says the talent level across the league makes it very competitive. I heard good things a lot about the any 10 Conference. Just because it's Division II doesn't mean there's not good players in here in this league. So, um, no, it, it, there's very good players in this league, and I'm glad to be a part of it. And it's very competitive, and that's that's what basketball is all about. Joining a new team is never easy, and Montague credits senior captains Dede Andrews and Charlie Russo in helping him mesh with his new teammates and become a leader as the season has gone on. Coming in here, I knew I was going to be new. I can just not step on foot or just like demand anything from anybody. I learned to just learn from Dede and uh, Charlie, two great players and um, two seniors that have great leadership skills. And over time, I learned how to give my insight as well, but also learn from them at the same time. So it's been a great, great cohesiveness and we have great chemistry on and off the courts, on and off the court in which we develop. So the New Hampshire is in the stretch run of the 2018-19 season. Montague says the season has been a roller coaster, but believes the team is poised to make a push for the postseason. They start off the year pretty great. Started off 3-0 and then towards the end of the season, uh, we uh, lost four in a row. So this season has been a roller coaster, but we just came off a big win against a very good Bentley team. Uh, which makes us two in a row and we have another tough game Saturday against Merrimack. So I like where this team's going and we're heading in the right direction at the right time towards postseason. And the real test will be Saturday against a second place Merrimack team and hopefully we can just keep on uh, riding this way, keep on winning. Comes around, goes back to his left, throws a no look pass to Montague for the slam. And one, what a job by SNHU.